Hello lovely people, how are you guys doing? What's up? In today's video, I'm gonna try to recreate a face chart on this face. This is the hairstyle of the month and I don't want to hear a single comment about it. Unless it's a compliment. If it's a compliment, yeah, I want to hear it. <laughs> In today's video, I'm gonna try to recreate a face chart. Now, usually with these kind of videos, we're taking it to a whole new level, baby. Up, up, up. We're not doing simple stuff here. What is my hand doing? Give me your breadcrumbs. This right here is the face chart that I'm gonna be trying to recreate on my face today. I know, it's a lot. It has a little bit of everything. Ah, this is such a bad idea, this is such a bad idea. Now, this face chart was made by the Instagram account Milk1422. You can find so many fun, creative face charts on their Instagram account. Definitely go check them out. But today, we're gonna try to recreate this one. Camera, am I a joke to you? Why am I doing this to myself? This looks way too complicated. All right, so first thing, why is my nose itchy? Like, it's not itchy inside, it's itchy on the outside. Uh. Oh, now it's itchy from the inside too. I'm so fortunate because my father gave me the thickest, the longest brow hairs I could ever wish for. I definitely got my eyebrow hairs from my father. Like, there is no other explanation. Anyways, if I want to be able to draw those hearts on my eyebrows, I will need to get rid of my eyebrows. Sorry, dad. I've never done that though. As much as I hate my eyebrows, I've never been that cruel with them. So I went to get some glue and I got these two. Why I got both of these? I don't know. Just wanted to have options. Now this is 90% natural ingredients. This one, 98. Oh my God, what are you? This is more natural than the food that you can order from some of those fast food restaurants. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I'm loving it. So I've seen people use glue to make their eyebrows disappear. I've never done it. It's gonna be chaotic. I should probably watch some YouTube tutorial on how to do that since I've never done it before. That's what smart people do. But who said I'm smart? <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. This is drying out so quickly. Maybe if I put some water. Oh my god, my eyebrow is screaming right now. What kind of magic is this? My eyebrows look so flat. They kind of remind me of my butt. Can somebody tell me when I should stop? Because I really don't know. I just keep on adding water and glue. Water and glue. Okay, I think that we're on a good way. Okay, now I'm going to cover this with powder. I have no idea what I'm doing, but it makes me happy. Okay, next I'm gonna apply some concealer. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> Goodbye, my lover. Goodbye, my friend. You can laugh. That's okay. I won't be mad. Goodbye, my lover. Goodbye, my friend. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Maybe I'm gonna need one more layer of powder. Wow, that's a lot of powder, that's a lot of powder. I don't want that powder to fall down my face. Am I doing baking right now? Probably. Oh no, some of my front brow hair is unstuck. And one more layer of concealer. Okay, we're definitely doing something. I don't know if this is how it's supposed to look, but most of my eyebrow is not visible anymore, so that's good. Ah, oh. <laughs> my eyebrows are screaming right now, but you can't really hear it because the glue is muting all the sound and screams and horror. Hey guys, look, my eyebrows match my personality. Camera, now is a great time to keep me out of focus. Okay, what are we doing here? I got this little palette here. It has some face paint in it. As you can tell, it's so tiny, so adorable, so easy to take with you wherever you're traveling. Nobody's traveling right now, but if you're traveling, it's very easy to take it with you. <laughs> I wish I could... I wish I could open it. Why is it not opening? Ah! Okay, obviously this is going to be my first time using it. Okay, 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 here is the hard part. So I'm gonna start off by drawing some hearts. I will probably make them a little bit more random. I won't really follow exactly how they're placed on that chart. Oh, 
Oh no, this will take me hours. What was I thinking? Okay, now I'm drawing the tail of my brow. Obviously, this is a lot higher than the natural tail of my brow. That's fine. We're definitely not going for something natural today. Okay, doesn't look okay, but somehow we're gonna make it work. Now, if you zoom in and you see really, really closely, you can see that there are tiny little shimmers in the hearts. So that means that we will need to shimmer those eyebrows up. Yeah, that's what I like. Oh. I think that the eyebrows can be a look on their own. <laughs> okay, now moving on to the makeup. I'm not really happy with the tail of the eyebrow. I don't really like how it came out, but I'm gonna try to fix it later on. I look crazy with these eyebrows. So for the eye makeup, oh, this is my favorite part. I wish the hearts on my eyebrows were a little bit more saturated. I wish they were I wish they were a little bit more colorful, but it is what it is. I'm not used to not seeing my brows. I kind of miss them now. Are they doing okay under all that glitter? <laughs> so we have some red in the inner corner, okay? Everything starts with this red color in the inner corner. Oh my god, I look scary. Then we're gonna get some orange and we're gonna place it right here next to the red. Oh no, oh no, I didn't think this through. You know what is my least favorite part when I'm doing so colorful looks like this? The amount of brushes I'll need to wash after that. Nobody talks about these things, but I'm here to tell you. It's gonna be devastating and I will have no one to complain to. <laughs> so that's why I'm complaining right now. <laughs> okay, some yellow right here next to the orange. If you guys are wondering what I'm using for all these colors, I'm using this color pop. She's a rainbow palette. Now I will switch to the BH Cosmetics Take Me Back to Brazil palette because in this color pop palette, I don't really have a green that I like. I mean, I don't like green in general, but this green is a little bit too pale. So I'm gonna take a mixture of this one and this one. Oh, I hate it. Hi green, where have you been? Why didn't you stay there? Okay, now we're moving on to something like turquoise. Oh my god, this is so pigmented. Then we have blue. This is so beautiful. It is so beautiful. And this is just a very rough draft of what we're doing. Um, I'm just placing the colors. And after I'm done with the placing, I'm gonna start perfecting. And last but not least, purple. <sighs> I'm alive and breathing. I think we're having an earthquake. No, we're not. Can you guys see how much my mirror is shaking? I think we're having an earthquake. Hmm, I think my mirror is not okay. Because we're definitely not having an earthquake. Next time someone tells you that you're wearing a lot of makeup, show them this video. Now I'm just cleaning the top part, making the eyeliner nice and crisp and sharp. There is one thing that I consider more fun than shimmers, glitters, and that thing is called gemstones. I got these from Amazon, by the way, super inexpensive. They look so pretty, but everyone, everyone underestimates how long it takes to glue them on. In 
the inner corner here we have very tiny small little gemstones and as it gets towards the outer corner the gemstones get bigger and bigger and bigger oh my god i would give everything for a gemstone this size i also put on a pair of lashes i did that off camera because i had to let my camera charge for a little bit so you can see that there are also some gemstones on the eyebrows i feel like my eyebrows are a little naked in this part here so let's fill them in with some gemstones gemstones on the eyebrows <laughs> Oh, the weather outside is frightful, but the fire is so delightful. Let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. No, don't let it snow. Who's going to clean that snow after that? I used to like snow, now I don't like it. Because it's beautiful only in the first 23 minutes. After that, it gets so soggy and... Ugh. Snow is overrated. It's beautiful to look at it from the window, but it gets very ugly if you have to walk on it or through it. Anyways, gemstones. Come on, little guy, stick, stick. Come on, you can do that. Hehe, <laughs> good boy. Oh my god, I love it. Someone please take the gemstones away from me. I'm gonna glue them all on my eyebrows today. <laughs> It might take me three days, but I'm gonna do it. I kinda wanna make a gemstone unibrow. <laughs> I added a few more gemstones than what the, um, the chart is showing us. I just wanted to make this front part of my eyebrows to look a little bit more full. And to be honest with you, I don't think that there is such a thing as too many gemstones. Saying that's too many gemstones, it's like you're saying, I had too much pasta. These are sentences that don't make any sense. Why well, I'm hitting myself? I don't know. My hands look like I'm a 90 years old lady. They're so dry. They're so crusty. They look like they've been through a lot. I don't even want to show them to you. I don't know if I'm the only one, but my hands in the winter, that's something you don't want to see. <laughs> okay, for the lower lash line, there is something like a black or very dark eyeshadow. I'm gonna need to get my lower lashes to look super extra long i don't have a pair of false lower lashes so i'm gonna try to work with whatever i have whatever my mom gifted me with you know which is a lot thanks mom my dad was generous with his eyebrow hairs too yes coffee give me powers to do that some gray eye pencil in the waterline Okay, and I think that we're pretty much done with the eyes. Maybe I'm gonna go back and do some touch-ups later on, but now we're moving on to the lips! Uh, guys, I just realized I don't have black lipstick. <laughs> My grandma will be so confused watching this video. She doesn't speak any English, so she's literally watching me put some random stuff on my face. I don't have a huge upper lip, so I will need to do some tricks. Who needs black lipstick when you have eyeliner? <laughs> I promise I'm going somewhere with this. My upper lip is literally half of all that. I'm just using some white paint all over my upper lip because I want to make those hearts really bright. And if I have lighter base, that will help boost the colors. So I'm just prepping this area here. I should have used the same technique on my eyebrows. That's why the colors on my eyebrows came a little bit more faded. Well, look how pigmented they are on my lips. Now let's go ahead and outline those, those hearts. Oh, this is so exciting. Every step of this look is like a little dose of excitement. And I'm gonna finish up this look with some lip gloss. I'm gonna put it only on my bottom lip because if I put it on my top lip, I will mess up the hearts. Look how cute they are. Ah! 
maybe maybe i'm trying not to touch my my lips when i'm talking that's why i'm talking like that <laughs> maybe i can add some lip gloss just here on top slightly above the hearts right on my mustache oh no this exaggerates my mustache hairs uh oh that was a bad idea that was a very bad idea okay anyways i'm gonna leave it like that day 84 of quarantine I have way too much free time. <laughs> I'm not gonna add any shimmers on the lips, although I'm dying to, but I wanna keep them that colorful and bright and saturated. I feel like after I added the shimmers on the eyebrows, they kinda, I don't know, it kinda toned down the colors. So I don't wanna do that to the lips. What do you guys think? I wanna hear your thoughts. Let me know down in the comments. It's intense, I know, it's too much, I know. It's even a little bit chaotic. I know, that's why I did it. It's like gothic, but colorful. It's like fierce, but happy. It's like sweet and sour. If I look at you like this, I look angry. But then if I do that, it gets so cheerful. Rainbow and cupcakes. Oh no, I have eyeliner on my teeth. I never thought that I would say that. <laughs> I would really appreciate it if you guys follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and if you wanna show your full support, like this video and subscribe to my channel. That's the best thing that you can do if you want to support me, my videos and everything that I do on here. If you want to see more intense looks like this one, hit that like button. That's how I know you want to see more of this. I also have a second channel. It will be right here below me. Thank you guys so, 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 so much for watching and hopefully I'll see you in my next one. Bye! Mwah.